Alan Ritchie Dairy, Pond 1, July 28, 2003. This is a smaller release of gas, but it's more consistent. Probably came from uh, uh, solids that weren't as embedded as deeply in the sludge as the first uh, observation. When the sludge layer is deep and the gas accumulations uh, at the base of the sludge become uh, large, then you get large eruptions. As the sludge is shallower, you have smaller uh, but more consistent bubbling. We're currently about 40 yards away from, uh, 30 to 40 yards away from the eruption that, that's in the center of screen. There is a huge eruption. Uh, that totals uh, circumference of solids at this point is about uh, three times the area that my pickup would require. If, uh, if you place my pickup out there on it, about three pickups worth. Huge eruption. This is the far side of the lagoon. We're a long ways away from that, but still getting a good picture of it. That's a lot of activity.